New video has emerged showing the moment a driver tried to beat a bright line on the new route from Miami to Orlando. Nicole's in the newsroom with the dramatic footage. Nicole. The accident happened in Melbourne on Wednesday, killing the driver of the SUV and injuring three passengers. We're now seeing the moment of impact and hearing from a good Samaritan who rushed over to help. Harrowing moments caught on camera in Melbourne. Watch as a car waits for a Brightline train to pass by Wednesday afternoon. Shortly after, an SUV zips around its left past a crossing arm and flashing lights. Then the train. Me and my showroom manager looked at each other and were like, what was that? Jacob Hungerford was working at a nearby business when he heard the collision. In the video, he's seen running outside immediately. The car was flipped over on its side and there was a... Uh, there was a lady hanging out of the back. Just She was covered in blood and she, all of them were saying, please help me, please help me. Inside the car, a man and three passengers. Melbourne police say the driver died and the passengers were taken to the hospital. The train was stopped for hours as police investigated. Honestly, I just, like I was telling them yesterday, it's just a lot of sadness in the air. A lot of sadness, you know. It makes me want to choke up thinking about it. With Brightline running between Orlando and Miami, there are more trains coming through Brevard County. Mayor Paul Alfrey wants drivers to realize that. Years ago, we had five or six trains maybe a day, and we're getting you know, five, six times that. So you, you really have to focus on your safety, your passenger safety, and really where your vehicle is. You can't stop on the track. Jacob says it's still tough processing what happened on Wednesday. I'm really sorry that this happened, and you know, I. It's, it's a rough lesson to learn. Police are still working to learn what caused the SUV to run through the crossing.